Chautauqua is a place that people come to enjoy over the course of a nine-week season each summer since 1874. There's something very unique about this experience. Until you've come here, it's really hard to, to kind of grasp what it's about. The four pillars of Chautauqua are arts, education, recreation, and religion. We've been here for over 140 years and it started in 1874. It is an educational center, yet it's a resort, it's on a lake. People come to take in the symphony, ballet, popular entertainment, opera, theater, lectures all day long. If you look at Road Scholar's uh, mission statement and you look at Chautauqua's mission statement, they're very similar. That whole aspect of lifelong learning in, an, in a vacation atmosphere is really what we're based upon. It seems to be such a good fit. This is our 23rd or 24th Road Scholar trip. The educational piece is really what we like. We need interesting people, always. Chautauqua is a livable community. It's what this week has been about. There's a Presbyterian house, there's a Jewish um, daily community center, there's one for Episcopalians, there's one for Catholics. So that is a very nice way to live. Chautauqua would be a place that I would think would be my ideal community to live in. I would describe it as an adult summer camp very picturesque grounds, old Victorian houses, these wonderful old bridges, hidden woodlands. There's all these little nooks and crannies. It's like this Renaissance place. The buildings are nearby, so you're not walking very far to get to something that you're interested in. The lectures themselves are um, in a very convenient place also. The lectures on this trip have been marvelous. Tom Brokaw and Daughter was one of the most moving lectures I've seen, but also the CEO of Coca-Cola. Some of the speakers that they had were, were outstanding. Uh, Kathleen Sibelius, uh, her take, uh, Ray LaHood, um, Department of Transportation, the music, the arts, the religious experience, the knowledge, the, the fitness. It captures, well, the Chautauqua experience. Yet to hear from a wide variety of people and have a wide variety of experiences. They don't really need to get on and off motor coaches to travel to other events. They're here for the week and we take good care of them at the hotel. The Athenaeum Hotel was built in 1881 and of course today you have all the modern day amenities and many of our rooms are absolutely stunning. We have a sailing program, three beaches, and the lake plays a, an important role for people's experience. The Chautauqua Bell it is an old paddle wheeler, a true historical boat, one of four in the uh, United States from the 19th century. The Chautauqua Bell Tower is one of those really iconic structures. It's within our logo, it's our part of our brand. A lady by the name of Carolyn Benton plays the chimes. You hear those bells ring, you know you're here. My fellow participants are so friendly. After about four or five minutes of finding common ground, it's like you're talking with old friends. Road Scholar participants are very unusual. They really are an extraordinary group. Many friendships are made. There was a lady who realized that she was here with her college roommate from 35 years ago. So there's a lot of of light minds and when you see that community come together inside a Road Scholar program, it's, it's very special.